Hello everyone. Uh, basically today I'd like uh, to share with you how to uh, do the configuration of this uh, smart switch uh, from our Vivo. So first of all, as before, we have to make sure everything is ready. So now we have to make sure one, you have to have the switch, and two, you have to this uh, existing Vivo or one, which have been connected to your smartphone. If you have no idea how to how to do the uh, configuration, you can follow our previous video. And you have to, of course, have your smartphone and have a touch light because during like the configuration, we are going to like uh, cut off the power. Uh, there may not be light, so basically you need a touch light. And uh, I have the phone, so I can take this phone as a touch light. And lastly, uh, you have to have the screwdriver. Uh, you know, any screwdriver can be the can can can, can be used for, for like uh, to open the socket. And uh, now, okay, let's uh, start. We we have to go for uh, this switch. Uh, before we start, we have to make sure you know you have to cut off the power to make sure it is safe during the configuration. Let's let's now go to the cut off the power. So here we have this uh, main DB and we have to cut off the power for this uh, switch. I, I'm going to do the configuration. So this one is the switch, so I cut off the power here. So now you can see it's uh, dark. So let's go for go to the switch. Uh, now you can see we have two switches and we are going to do setting with this one. Just now I off the power already. <coughs> so first of all, I take out this uh, switch. Okay, now it's like a you now, so just give one. Okay, now we have this switch. So basically, uh, now I have to uh, dismantle this existing switch. So maybe give me some lights. Yeah. So you have two screws here. You have to like. Uh, Okay, so we have successfully dismantled the switch, so you can go back and you can see there's uh, a few wires and um, let me see, this is L wire and uh, this is uh, this is L and neutral, so I'll just take off this one. Because I think this one switch controls three lights, so that's why there are three wires. This is L, this is neutral. So basically, we have to now we come to the new switch. Now we have this new switch, and uh, first of all, we have to take off the front cover. Okay, here you can see this uh, space, and you see you do. Uh... Oh, sorry. Okay, so we take off already, and now we connect. So you can go back to this one, you can see there's one L, this is light one. So basically it's for light, this is for neutral. So because we have three, so we connect this tree to this. Uh... Oh. oh, it's a little too much. Okay, now this one connects, this one is for the neutral. Neutral, you have to lose this, uh, make it loose, loose, and it's going. And now, okay, tighten it. So it looks like okay. So now we go we plug in this. Uh,
Okay, finally we, we, we install it. Okay, now we uh, we we put up this cover. Okay, now it looks like okay. Let's now uh, turn on the power back. Just give one minute. Now we try to press. You can see the. the and the lights back. So basically now we can uh, physically control this uh, lights by this switch already means we already successfully uh, installed the switch. So now we do the configurations. <coughs> so now let's see our smartphone. Does it go to the Vivo apps? So this Vivo apps, we have this all one connected already. That's why I see at the beginning you have to make sure this all one already been connected with your phone. If you don't know how to connect to do, how to do the configuration? You have to follow our previous uh, previous video. So okay, I put here add uh, device type. Add like ordinary lights and put a uh, light uh, tree. Okay, save. So now I have this light tree. So how to connect this view our one to the switch? Now we go back to the switch. We go back to the switch. Okay, you press this button and hold until there's a beep. So we press and hold until there's a beep. I just gonna... There's a beep. So basically now we do one. Okay, already success. When there's a beep, you go back to the phone and touch this on and off button. It means it's been successful, successfully connect this switch to this phone. So now let's try the phone. Okay, so you can see you can control the on and off here. Right. So basically, it's, this is what you know. It's it's quite simple, right? So we just need to uh, physically install the switch and do a simple like a configuration in the phone. You can you can you can control remotely. Even you are not in the house, you can you can control abroad. Uh, that's all. Uh, it's basically the same when you do. This is the one. This is a. Uh, a one-way switch, you, it's the same, you do the two-way and three-way, basically it's all the same. Uh, I think that's all, if, uh, if you have more questions, you can contact us and uh, we are always here, okay?